watch fireflies. What did you say? I said, can you see if they've left yet? I wish I'd been born a cat so I could see in the dark. Well, I don't think I'll wait for her. I'm just gonna get a book and go to my room. Does your jaw hurt tonight, Jeff? Not bad. Then stay a little longer. We'd like to have you. Jeff, you're afraid you must get 267 minutes away. Surely you can afford another 10 cents worth. All right, my statistical friend. My curiosity is good for 10 minutes more. I wonder what she's like. Miss Wheeler says they're one of the wealthiest families in America. Oh, that's bad. She'll have an expensive camera she can work, a ray butt artist I've never heard of. Oh, sick. Has money spoiled me? Do you have money, fairy? Bags. <laughs> Let's not be prejudiced about money. Some of my best friends are wealthy. Hannah, we'll play something while we're waiting. Help distract Jeff. Well, you catch me in two. What shall it be? Surprise us. How about Gypsy Carters? Oh, don't play Gypsy Music, Hannibal. It frightens me. Frightens you? It terrifies me. I was stolen by gypsies when I was a child and rescued just as they're about to dye my skin with walnut juice. Say goodbye to you, Mother. I do not like thee, Lily Bell, the reason why I cannot tell. But this I know and know full well. I do not like thee, Lily Bell. She's been chanting that over and over all the way down here. Your children are leaving, Mrs. Savage. Wouldn't you like to say goodbye to them? They would like to say goodbye to you, Mrs. Savage. The fireflies are out. How lovely. What makes them light up, Doctor? Are they mating? I really couldn't say, Mrs. Savage. Thought you'd know. Isn't this a bug house? This is the cloisters. This is to be your home. I am Doctor of it. Wouldn't it be fascinating if human beings glowed while they made it? Do you light up while you make Lily Bell? Lord knows you're flighty. We might as well go, Titus. She's going to be unpleasant again. Certainly, Mother, you're not going to let us depart in an atmosphere of bitterness. Fifty needles and fifty pins and fifty dirty Republicans. She's determined to take the wrong attitude about this. It's futile. Well, time will take care of this. Come, Samuel. I'll send more of her clothes down later. We couldn't pack but one grip under the circumstances. Well, Sunday is visitor's day, if you care to bring them down then. Well, my sister is departing for Paris next week, but we'll make arrangements. Good night, Mother. If you need anything, Mrs. Savage, Miss Willie is here to take care of you. Exaggeration. It's stupid of me and try to irritate them like this. I just irritate myself. Well, I suppose it has to be exasperating now to be funny later. I notice one of his eyes is gone. They must have dropped out in the office. I'll look as soon as they go. Don't bother. It fell at last fall at the opera. I'd have found it, but the usher was so nasty about me lighting matches during the magic fire music. You know what this is, don't you? Suppose you tell me. It's a teddy bear. 
Surely you've seen one before. Not that big. Do you know what I do with it? I couldn't possibly guess. I sleep with it. Do you? Yes, I do. Are you going to talk to me as if I were an imbecile too? Here, here, we mustn't be hostile. Of course not. You haven't harmed me.